Hey, what's up? This is Adrenaline 45 Films, and I'll be teaching you how to make a quick muzzle flash and smoke effect uh, with Motion 5. So, let's get started. First, open up Motion 5, um, and here is a quick, uh, quick demonstration of a muzzle flash in action. And this is just very quick, very quick edited. Uh, it's not perfect. But uh, I'll just show you what it looks like. Um, okay. So, there's the very bad quick effect. And let me just delete all this and show you how I did all it. Okay, so um, now that you have uh, Motion Live opened up, uh, what you first want to do is just grab your footage. This is just me. Um, holding a gun in place, um, like I was actually shooting. Um, just gonna resize this a bit. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna resize really quick. Okay, so here is our footage. Oh, let me. Okay, there is our footage. Let me just trim it down a bit. Okay. So extend that a bit. Okay. Uh, now our footage is ready. Oops. Okay, that's what we will be working with. Um, so after you have your footage set in place and everything, uh, what you want to do is uh, just you want to go to uh, your pictures. Um, usually, you would have your uh, muzzle flash right here, but uh, I just did a quick search on Google muzzle flashes, and I just uh, copied a picture. Uh, make sure when you search up and copy your muzzle flash that it has a back black uh, background like this so you can um, edit it out and it looks real so we will just take this muzzle flash let me see exactly where I shoot first so you just want to get this ready before you want to get that ready before uh, you import your muzzle flash so it's ready and prepared uh, now you just want to um, place that drag and drop. Um, actually, you want to make this its own group, the muzzle flash. Um, so, yeah, basically what you want to do is click on when it's here. You just want to click group because before the muzzle flash was in this group with the movie and you don't want that. You just want each separate uh, group. So it looks like that, okay? Um, so now it's in, in its uh, separate group. You wanna um, place it over here. Oh, and as you can see, um, the muzzle flash has its back black background, right? So uh, I'll show you how to get rid of that. You just wanna right click uh, and go all the way down to blend mode and press add. And it'll just get rid of all the black uh, black background. Uh, you just want to resize your uh, muzzle flash so it's right there and boom. Let's see how that is. Oh my bad. Um, <laughs> uh, obviously a muzzle flash does not last that long so we will um, shorten it a lot. <laughs> so here um, just find the correct sizing and stuff. Oh, it's too early. Never mind. Uh, let's take that. Uh, you want to mess around with this a little bit so uh, so you get like exactly where to uh, shoot this. Um, let me see if I could put that up here more. Yeah, it's a bit better. Um, kind of not really, but uh, yeah, it's just what we have right now. So 
yeah. Um, let's see. Okay. So that is our, our muzzle, muzzle flash right there. Um, and now we will, I'll demonstrate how to um, add your smoke effect. Um, this takes a lot of um, messing around with and getting it right. Um, so if I mess up really bad, which I probably will, uh, please don't mind it. Uh, it's just a quick tutorial. Uh, so what you want to go go do is go to your library, uh, click on particle emitters, emitters. I don't know how to say that, but click here <laughs> and go down to smoke and go click on smoke variation. Okay, and drag it over. You want you don't want to put the smoke exactly where uh your muzzle flash is because this smoke kind of has a delay. Um, so you kind of just want to add it a little before, like maybe right there, I think. Um, let's see. No, it's a, it's a little bit too early. So, um, just move it there, kind of. No, it's a bit too early. As I said, guys, this takes a lot of uh, messing around with. Um, so, so here's your smoke, right here. Um, it's right, it's right here, uh, as you can see, and we'll move that over to the gun point. Uh, let me just get it over here, and we'll drag this right around here. Okay, um, so once you drag it there, that's not all you have to do. Uh, you have to do a bit, a little bit more. Um, as I said, it takes a lot of messing around with. Um, and quick uh, motion tracking is basically um, recording your uh, actions with your keyframes. So um, since it's really quick, I just I'm just gonna uh, do that um, so let's do that instead I'm just gonna fast forward with this so it tracks down the uh, muzzle flash right there now we will uh, move along with it Okay. Yeah, we're gonna move along with that. Just, just kind of move along with the uh, gunpoint as you keep recording. Um, and until you reach, like, when you settle down with the gun, uh, then you m most likely want to stop there. Um. And that's how you do that smoke. Um, let me just finish that quickly. Okay. So, I know it's going to suck, but let me see just how it looks like. Oh my gosh, my bad. Yeah, after you're done keyframing, you want to uh, uh, click the record button so it stops. And uh, let me see. Yeah, it's decent, but uh, we can make that a little better. Um, so that's kind of how you add your smoke effect. Um, as I'm saying again, it takes a lot more uh, messing around with and editing. Um, so that's like how you do the effect. You can like do a lot more with it like stretch it out as I'm doing right now you can raise the height lower the end point you can do a lot with with this um, and you can just adjust it a lot oh um let me see yeah messing around with it it's actually uh, cooler to do 
than motion tracking because motion tracking will kind of like uh, j it, you can't really edit that as much as you can with uh, recording your keyframes. Um, so that's pretty cool. I I like that about this quick what I call quick motion tracking, um, and it's easy for beginners. Um, I'm not necessarily a beginner. I wouldn't really call myself a beginner, but um, maybe I am. <laughs> Who knows? Um, I am sort of new into this uh, into this filming, um, but I'm not so new, and I'm not too old, so I still have a lot more to learn. You see? Um, yeah, that's kind of how you want it. You want to rotate that a bit, um, so it, so you can see that it follows, like, kind of where your bullet would be, like that, um, and that's how you do your smoke effect. So let's just see, it's just a straight run now. Yeah, that's um, a really bad example, but um, it's quick and it's easy. Um, and so yeah, this is how you do your muzzle, a quick muzzle flash uh, with smoke effect. Um, thanks guys for watching. Uh, this is Adrenaline 45 Films. Um, please subscribe, um, like, comment, rate, do whatever. <laughs> and um, uh, please don't forget to watch my other short films and other films that I'll be making in the future. Um, and I'll be making more tutorials on how to do um, other things like explosions, um, maybe cloning, like a lot more other things. So um, just be tuned in to my channel. Um, I'll be posting um, a lot more tutorials and films. And see you guys later. Peace out.